Hi, I'm Dave from WebSkis.com and today we're going to talk about S5 wheels and how to take the bearings out and then repress the bearings back into the wheel. So, first thing we're going to do is we're going to look at the bearing here. The outside metal portion of the bearing is called the race and the uh, black portion here is the seal. That actually covers the bearings. Whenever we're working with bearings, you want to always work on the race. If you press on this seal, it's going to end up crushing the bearings and you'll need to get new bearings. So, keep that in mind when we're working on these. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to get a handy dandy tool here to punch out the bearing. Um, there's a brass fitting in here, so if you can find something that will fit in that brass fitting to push it through the wheel, that's perfect. Um, this punch works really well. So I'm going to slot it right in there, gently tap it through, pops out one side of the bearing. There we go. And then you can just take it, turn it around. Pop out the second side, and voila, there you have it. Bearings punched out of the wheel. When you want to put your bearings back in the wheel, what you're going to do is you're going to take that first bearing, put it right in there, set it. If you've got a vise, this works really well. If not, you can just use a plain old hammer at home. Press that first bearing in until it's flush. Take that brass fitting. Right in the middle there, second bearing, slides right in, and press. Perfect, and you're ready to go. I'm Dave from WebSkis.com and that's how to change bearings in an S5 wheel.